go, let go, let go. What's happening, family? Welcome back to my Black Universe. You know what time it is. Time for another unboxing from Inspire. We got their newest earbuds. By the way, if you haven't checked out the Echo Buds unboxing, hit that card above or the link below. But let's get into the newest product to unveil the Echo Buds Mini. Now, this packaging was more involved. So, you have the bright green box. You know what I'm saying? There's a certain YouTuber that, you know, flicks it. You know what I'm saying? Pluck it and flick it to the side. I didn't do that like they did, but I kind of did like they did. Shout out to Flossie Carter. We got the thank you note. Pause to read. Uh, like a little infographic. That's pretty cool. Like I said, it's more in depth. You got to, you know, check them out. Check out the old video. Check this one out. Just to get a side by side comparison. Got some discount codes, you know what I'm saying? Get some money off. That's always helpful. And the product you came to see. Now, I've already been using these. I'm going to do a uh, thorough review. But uh, as you see, it has fingerprint touch, Bluetooth 5.0, IPX5 waterproof, USB Type C connectivity. 500 milliamp charging case, 50 milliamps per bud, and seven hours playback. Of course, I'm gonna test all this and give you guys the absolute real. Um, so let's get up in this joint. You know what I'm saying? Pop the box open. You know what I'm saying? Get through all that tape. And this was a simple unboxing. It's actually pretty dope, and I like this. I like the way it's set up. Bam. Straightforward. Put the knife away. So we got our cable, USB, USB Type A. You know what I'm saying? Step into the future, step forward. Then we got our ear tips. You have other ear tips. Those are the small and large. It comes pre-installed with the medium. Underneath you have your instructions. Yeah, it was a struggle to get that out. So I like the color. Now these only come in that white and rose gold color. They don't come in black or blue or anything like that. And I wish they did. That's one thing I wish they would have done. Was done multiple colors. But bam. USB Type C right there on the back. You got the four LEDs in the front. You got the Inspire logo in rose gold. You see it's in white. It's got the little plastic tape that's the to keep from the battery from draining. While you're waiting to get it. It's a man uh and it's a magnetic latch case. Yeah, I was struggling to get this tape out. Hey, your boy struggles sometimes with the daggum tape. Come on, bro. There we go. Yeah, I took it off camera. I was like, I'm struggling with the camera. Because I was trying to look through the camera and do it, but then I don't work like that. I don't work like that. I'm still struggling. Okay, there we go. We got it. I think I, think I should have paused it. I just did it off camera. Maybe I'll watch our show. Oh, see, you see, you know what I'm saying? Efficiency. We get faster every time. We get better every time. It's a plastic housing, plastic case. Um, the earbuds are encased in plastic, but it's um, it's a, it's not a cheap plastic. It's not necessarily a textured plastic either. So it's different. But we'll we'll discuss that in more in depth in the uh, review video. I just want to show you guys the product real quick. Let's get all this stuff out of the way. Ear tips. Yeah, I have to pull them back. I'm like, come on, bro. You know, you know the mediums ain't gonna spit your ear. 
and get a good seal. Always make sure you get the right ear size to fit your ear to get that good seal for the best sound quality. All right, so we're back in the phone. OnePlus 7 Pro. I should've got the Inspire phone. I'll do that for the review. I'll grab their phone to put it together, make it work. Show you how it does when it connects. Cause it flashes red and blue. And when it connects, it's blue. And it doesn't have a, um, it makes an audible sound, but it's not like a voice or anything like that. It's not like the Raycon or any of these other brands where they have a signature sound uh, yet. That's not one I noticed yet, but I think they're working on that. And it'd be dope to see them do that. So we got connected and I did a listening test. And I didn't say nothing to this listening test. So we're going to cut the video right here. You guys got to come back for the review. We're going to do a full listen test. We're going to compare it against the Raycon E25s, the E55s, and the Echo Buds. All right. Now, these are the Echo Buds Mini. I can tell you right now, these are my favorite gym earbuds because I sold my E100s because uh, they had that textured plastic that kept them water resistant. But these right here, oh yeah. And they bump. See you guys in the next video. Peace and black empowerment. Mm -hmm.